Hello students, today the topic is gravitation. It was Newton who said that every object in universe attracts to the other object in universe with a certain force. The force with which two objects attract each other is called the force of gravitation. The force of gravitation acts even the two objects are not connected by any means. If, however, the masses of the objects are small, the force of gravitation between them is small and cannot be detected easily. Now, the universal law of gravitation. According to this law, the gravitational force between two objects in universe is directly proportional to the product of masses of the particles and is inversely proportional to the square of the distance between the particles. The direction of this force is along the line joining the two particles. Mathematical derivation. Suppose A and B are the two particles having mass m1 and m2 respectively and they are separated by a distance small r. Then by the law of gravitation the particle A attracts the particle B with a force F such that F is directly proportional to the M1 and multiply by M2 and F is inversely proportional to the R to power 2. Now M F is directly proportional to the M1 M2 upon R square here G is a capital G is a constant which is called the universal gravitational constant. Definition of G If M1 equals to M2 equals to 1 and R equals to 1 then from above equation we can write F equals to G. So, universal gravitational constant may be defined as the force of attraction between two bodies of unit mass each when kept with their centers a unit distance apart. Units of G We know gravitational force F equals to capital G M1 M2 upon R square. So G equals to F multiply R square upon M1 M2 in SI unit. G equals to Newton meter square upon kilogram square and in CGS 
g equals to dyne multiply centimeter square upon cramp square now value of g in si g equals to 6.67 multiply 10 is to power minus 11 newton meter square per kilogram square and in CGS G equals to 6.67 multiply 10 is to power minus 8 times centimeter square upon gram square now the important characteristics of the gravitational force first Gravitational force between two bodies form an action and repair reaction pair that is the forces are equal in magnitude but opposite in direction. Second it is a conservative force third it is a long race long range force that means between Two bodies gravitational force is effective even if their distance of separation is very large. For example, gravitational force between the sun and the earth is of the order of 10 to power 22 newton. Although distance between them is 1.5 into 10 to power 8 kilometer. Now fourth, it is a central force. Fifth, it is independent of the nature of intervening medium.